Alright guys, this is a haul video and this is the first of its kind because I usually do lookbooks as a haul, especially if it's a Chinese based clothing company. Now, um, I grouped all of these together because I've had these items for about a month or two and honestly you guys, I have my favorites but I have to say this. Be careful when you are ordering from these Chinese based clothing manufacturing companies. I have been in this industry long enough to know the difference in American US sizing and Chinese based sizing and they don't have it that well. Not only that, the quality of some of their items is not what they should be. Their quality unfortunately is garbage. That might be a little mean but it's the truth. So other than that I'm just showing you guys what has been sent to me. There is a particular company that I am going to mention that I just I love them. Now yeah their quality is not always that good with fit but as far as how their apparel is made, it's pretty, pretty darn good. But yeah, just, just stay tuned. <laughs> so let's start off with my favorite company, banggood.com. I have actually ordered from them, even though these items were sent to me. The camera that I am recording on, I actually purchased a lens from them and got it fairly quickly. So they're shipping is pretty fast however they always send me a lot of items i love their jewelry and their clothing and this is just really my favorite company and this is definitely my favorite piece out of the bunch it is so versatile and i love the many different ways that i could wear it So next is We Queen, and you've seen this uh, top dress in a recent video. I'm definitely going to have to change the neckline because it was just too high. And this dress was cute on the website, but hey, what can you say? Now, Rose Gal sent me some really cute items. I love these glasses necklace. It's a nice little accessory I've fallen in love with. This cute bag, which I think I'm about to do a giveaway with it. I think it was constructed very well, despite you can see some uh, thread hanging from it, but it's, it's very roomy, I can say that. And they sent me a skirt that there was no way I was going to fit it, so I gave it to my stepdaughter. Now here with Dresslink. I do not like this company. I'm just going to be totally honest. Half the stuff that I picked out did not fit, no matter if it was a size extra large. And some of it was just poorly designed, I guess. This top, I really did like it, but it was just too tight in certain areas. And I loved this skirt, but it was just not finished very well. It had loose threads, ends that weren't finished. And you guys know I'm a fashion enthusiast. So when it comes to finishings and garments, they get a F <laughs> when it comes to that. I did get this scarf, I did pick this skirt, this scarf out and I liked it because I knew it was going to match with a pair of shoes that I have already purchased from a store here in the area that I lived in. They also sent me a dress and as you can see it's not on my body, it's on her body and I don't even know why they thought this extra large was even going to fit me. Then each buyer. Um, they're fairly new, but they sent me two items that I am highly in love with. I love this blouse. I haven't had one in years. It has some awkward pockets in the top, and you can see 
the cuffs are kind of weird and lighter in color. And this is my favorite lightweight sweater. I just love the print on this sweater. All right, guys, that's it. Remember my tip. Be careful with these Chinese-based clothing companies. The fit and the quality is not always the best. And if you are not familiar or you do not know how to alter or fix the quality of these items, I would say kind of steer away from it. But other than that, guys, this is it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you are subscribed to my second cha channel, uh, Beauty Cut Right Fitness. I have been posting videos there. You've probably missed it. I know you guys are wondering about my whole weight loss journey and what's going on. And I've actually been posting a lot of that information onto that channel. So make sure you subscribe to that channel. Also, make sure you're following me on every social media you possibly can, especially Instagram and Facebook because I post very often to those two social um, media sites. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed this video and the tip. Love you guys. <laughs> Bye.